All right, hey guys, quick note here. I didn't make a mistake. I do remember when I first got this Zenith television, this is just a quick note to part two, I did replace this selenium rectifier here because the, the problem that I, when I first got the set, the picture was shaken. It wouldn't, wouldn't it just like twisting and shaking really bad and this is usually a culprit. This will also cause it to lose sync where the horizontal line and the vertical will not lock. Uh, it'll freewheel. So, but this could actually be a problem. So I'm going to have to, I'm going to go ahead and replace that. Um, I got some um, new old stock, but I'm not even going to worry about that. That's a, that's a new old stock from, there from ITT Tech. And if I read the chart back here, Zenith, so there at the bottom you have the Zenith that calls for a 103-20. That's what's in it. So that's an original Zenith. That's a, either an original Zenith or it's a replacement part. Uh, but I don't really trust some of this old new old stock. I mean, there's one there too. Besides, this one's not even the correct one. Uh, this one is a, I dropped it. That was just lovely. Yeah, real quick here. I don't want to keep this video long. It's a 1616, so it's not the right one. It would be like this one here where your middle, you know, you have an out, out, and in. But remember that box of parts that guy gave me that stripped out a television because the horizontal wasn't locking? Uh, probably a bad integrator. I was going through my old spare Zenith parts that I had here that guy gave me, and I found this. Uh, some uh, diodes here, and they're, they are from a horizontal circuit. Those are the phase detector diodes, probably out of the set that he junked. I'm going to test them. They should be fine. I'm going to jerk that out of there, and I'm going to put these in there, and we're going to give her a test. So I'll do that in video number three. So doing the simplest things first, I'll do that, and then if that didn't do it, then we'll probably have to go for these integrators and maybe these resistors. I'm still looking this up in my SAMS photo facts to see what resistor is supposed to really be there. All right, guys, just a fast note. Thanks for watching.